Hey guys, in this video, I'll show you how to clone any website to Elementor. First of all, open any type of preferred browser on your PC and search for softlight.io. After that, you will be redirected to this web page. Here, scroll down to the pricing plans and you can see that there are four plans available. If you want, you can try getting a paid plan, but I will recommend using the free one so that you can get to know the software better. So just click on the try now button and you will be prompted to either sign in or create a new account. After signing in, tap on the new project button at top left corner and a pop-up will open up. Inside this pop-up menu, enter the project name of your preference and then enter the domain of the web page that you would like to clone. You can just access the website, copy its link, and then paste it into the field. Make sure to remove all of the unnecessary parts of the URL and then click on the Create Project button. You can clone any website that you like. After creating a project, you will be prompted to download the Chrome extension on your browser. In order to do that, click on the extension embed and Chrome Web Store will be launched. Inside it, click on the Add to Chrome button and install it completely. Once done, look for the website you would like to clone and then open the clone extension. After that, choose the project you created for that website and then click on Add Page. Now, you will be redirected to this web page. Here, tap on any part of the screen, select any profile, and then click on the export button at bottom right corner. After that, the HTML code will copy to your clipboard. Simply navigate back to your Elementor website and access the website editor. As you can see, I'm using WordPress, but the process is the same for Elementor, so don't worry. Now, you can just get to the code editor and paste this CSS code to get the same web page. Since I don't have a paid plan, I won't be able to show it to you, but the process is just like the way I explained it. So that's all for this video. If this video was helpful, don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button. Thanks.